God, this guy is such a jerk. Ponyo, how the hell you put up with all this crap out of all the years that you've been here? Actually, I have no idea how long you guys have been here, so I'm not going to question it. Let's just go and get this crap over with. So says me. And this thing. We'll get to that sometime later. So, hello guys. Welcome back to another episode of Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door. I have no idea how we were able to shake that bush back there. And why are you jumping over bushes? Come on, let's do this. In the last episode, we uh, made friends with Madame Flurry, the Wind Spirit, and we're now here in the Great Boggly Tree to try to free everyone. I remember, there we go. A power punch. I remember it was used to be in one of these. Ah, okay, oh, shoot. The fuck is that thing right there? I think it's an X yuck or something. Or just yucks. That's a yux. Says here is a creature created in the X not labs. Max HP is three, attack is two, defense is zero. According to this, attacks and items won't affect it if it has mini yux around it. So if any mini yux appear, take those out first. Duh. What the fuck? Oh, okay, that sounds nice. And this. Now, that's a mini yuck. A creature made to protect a yuck. It can split into two. Let's HP is one, attack is zero, and defense is zero. These twerps are the reason you sometimes can't do any damage in the main yuck. They're a pain, but you have to beat them before the yucks. Fl Floor is pretty effective. No, two poison mushrooms! Where do they even come from? I'm very curious. Shit. Oh god, please don't let me get it, please don't let me get it. Oh thank god! Oh, I was so close, because that's the shine sprite, it's the poison mushroom. Oh god, that was horrible. I do not want to get a poison mushroom, because, oh, horrible, oh, the worst thing happens. Ow, I get smacked in the face? That's not the terrible thing that I was talking about, but still. Yeah, because of these mini ups, it forms a little barrier. And you can't touch it, unless you defeat all the ups. And... The barrier deactivates. Or, in this case, breaks. Like paper. Well, paper doesn't exactly break, it tears. But whatever. Okay, bush, nothing, 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 nothing here, nothing here. Okay, got it. And we come up here. Oh, Jesus! That's done. God, he scared the crap out of me. I didn't even see that attack. It just came in like, whoosh. <laughs> Man, this is brutal. How much longer until we find that stupid crystal star? Not even those pun puny puny. They look puny puny. Oh, God. Puny punnies we catch and know anything about it. And they live here. After all this pointless searching, I'm thinking we're looking in the wrong place. Um, ouch. Where did he come from? He suddenly didn't come out, did not come out of that hole in the pipe. Elder! Onion, is that you? You're looking well. Um, uh, can you just, like, I don't know, turn into the first dimension and just, like, squeeze through the bars? Why are you so calm, Elder? You're trapped. And this is our darling rescue to you. Well, we're rescuing, is it? Well, thanks, I suppose. Those are quite exciting. But I think you ought to help the other units before you rescue me. Where are the others? Hmm. Let me think. Where was I? Ah, oh, yes, right. Your question. The rest of the punkies, unfortunately, are locked away in the other cell. I don't mind telling you. Those old foul goons just have no consideration whatsoever. Well, the elderly. Not none, I tell you. Honestly, I have to ask. What's a pony like me supposed to do in a, in a situation like this, I ask you? Please, I want to know. Listen, yes, listen to your elder. I have to say something. What the hell? I need you. Listen up. Oh. Is that my ponyo? 
Look, he's still talking. Batuni, thank heavens! You're here! You're safe! I knew you'd come for me, Ponyo. I just knew it! Um, they are brother and sister, right? That makes it sound like this is a... Not his girlfriend he's rescuing. But either way, damsel in the stress cliche. Well, that, that was already a cliche because we had Princess Peach being captured, but now we have Petuni being captured. So, yep, another damsel in the stress cliche. Of course I would, dear sister, and I brought us a mighty ally. Look at him. We're going to get you out of there right away, I swear. You just hold tight for a second. Okay. Really? Hold tight? You, you, you dumbass. Mario, listen, we got to find a cell key or we're going nowhere. Uh, yeah, that much is pretty much self-explanatory. So let's go over here. Oh, well, it's a missile tree. We must stop meeting like this, don't you think? Hey, stop right there, Missy. You're the thieving girl we saw before. What are you doing here? Well, anyway, I've heard... Notice how she ignores the question. Well, anyway, I've heard there were nice badges to be found here, so I came looking. Only well, problem is I've been running into more trouble than I expected. Oh, come on. <laughs> well, who cares about that? Lovely to see you again. Ew, not another smooch. Who do you think you are, you total floozy? The precious crystal star you're looking for is near the bottom of this tree. Good luck finding it before the others. <laughs> Take care of my handsome stash, superstar. Let's get together again soon. Oh, God. I can't believe that girl. Ugh, I can't stand her. The pony was looking at the question like, what, this, what the hell just happened? Ugh, my aching... Hey, you! You're the dirtbag who hit me from behind, aren't you? Yeah, real fair, you scum. You fight dirty, you get dirty. And I'll be doing the dirty. What the hell does that supposed to mean? Another dizzy dial? God. I like how the audience just goes nuts when you do a stylish move. And they're spinning like that. <laughs> We got the red key. And, oh, this chest, nothing. This bush, nothing. And what's in here? We got an ultra serum. Awesome. Well, that's really helpful. Let's use the red key on this now. Alright, red key. There we go. Elder, we're back. We're here to rescue you. Foolish child! Ponyo, sit down this instant and keep your mouth shut. Huh? What? Why? What did I do? Uh, listen, Elder, I don't know why you're mad, but we came here to help you. Stop your mumbling, you, and mind your elders, you whelp. How could you abandon your poor sister and run off like that? Absolutely shameful. But, but, Elder, I, I just want to find help. To help rescue you. Oh, stop with the why. You never interrupt an Elder Mint lecture. Never. You wonder why the other companies call you a doofus sometimes? That's why. And your time to be a doofus is over because you have a, uh, to lead our money trap one day. That day is not for all, and that is why you need to listen. Now, first of all, several hours later. <laughs> oh, oh, God. Oh my, uh, I fell asleep, I'm sorry. You have no idea how long this old bat was talking. God! <sighs> talking about them leading the tribe, talking about marital problems, children, police, the economy. Oh my God, it would not stop. Or else, you got that? From now on, you got to get your act together, Ponyo. Yes, Elder, yes, I understand. <coughs> Bah! Only answer once. But say, by the way, why are you here anyway? Uh, I was just telling you, we came to rescue you. We started with you, Elder. Oh, is that so? Well, good. In that case, get me out of here already. Criminy! This cell is cold, which isn't good for your old bag. And there's this damp stench. Uh, well, there she goes. Enough standing around. I love how you just leave us snoring in the other cell. And you can still heal the snoring. Just you wait, Petunia. I'll be right back for you. And we just having to wake up. Okay, big brother. I'll be waiting. Oh, that's nice. Alright. Going out of the pipe. 
jump. Aw, I thought we would jump on the pipe. Darn it. We just left Ponyo up there. <laughs> Alright, what the fuck up? Uh, come on. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Let me do this. I kinda need it. <laughs> well, if it is a pony, yo. <laughs> you heard me. <laughs> I can't say I expected you to manage the rest of the other. I told you I could do it. Don't get a swelled head. This doesn't mean I'll accept you as our leader. And it definitely doesn't mean I completely trust that mustache guy either. For stars, you still haven't rescued the other ponies yet. I'm not lifting an antenna to help you until you do. You stubborn mule! Deplorable, how dare you talk like that, knowing what we're up against. We must stand together now, we must take back our treat. D don't you understand that? But, but Elder... Shut your trap, Winnipper, and mind me, you hear? You'll help Mustache over here. What'd you say your name was again? It was, er, it was Marty, wasn't it? It's Mario. He's Mario. I mean, sheesh. He's only world famous. Come on. At first you didn't even know who he is. And now you say you know he's world famous? Shut up, Ponyo. Yes, yes. Simmer down, you. Everyone else, help Martio clear out our tree. All right, Elder. Whatever you say. I'm not heartless or anything, to tell you the truth. I'm worried about Petunia, too. Oh, my God. Hey, you're right. We have no choice. We must fight. Right, everyone? There you go, my ponies. That's the spirit. Ten ponies, join your party! Thanks, you guys. Hey, if you're done rallying everyone, I have a question. We're looking for this crystal star thingamajig. Why would you say thingamajig? You know what it is! You just said it! Ever heard of it? The crystal star, eh? Hmm. Yes, perhaps. Hitting down, down, down at the bottom of this tree is a funny colored stone. But what we do with it? Alright, guard it from evil and give it to a pure heart. That's what generations of elders have been taught. Might be the crystal star. Marty, or Mike, Martio, I'm thinking you better get it before those goons do. I don't quite see how just yet, but I bet it's concerned to us getting our tree back. Connected to us getting our tree back. You got all that, Martio? Whistle Star, bottom part of the tree. Get to it. Oh, hold your horses. I forgot something. Before you get the Crystal Star, you must save all the captured punnies. Yep, you'll never get that gem without the help of punnies. Not a chance. So here, you better take this. It's the punny orb. It's the symbol of our leader. It's a sun. If you place this in the pedestal that you see around the tree, the punnies will gather. Just remember to take the orb with you when you're done using it. Because, well, if you don't, everyone will just kind of hang out and stare at the orb. <laughs> Did you hear what he just said? Oh, yeah. <laughs> you got the punny orb, the emblem of the punny leader given you by the elder. All right, guys, let's go rescue everyone. Oh, jeez. Oh, and one more thing. So sorry, so sorry. I've been awfully forgetful as of late. Now then, where was I? All oh, right, on your way to the Crystal Star. If you lose any of your ponies that have a hard time finding them, just come to me. What I'll do is I'll give a whistle to call them back here. You got all that? No, not really. All right, let's get. Gosh, go, you go up the pipe, dang it! All right, here we are. Now you see this right here. All right, do put the pony over there. You place a punny orb, and everyone just kind of stands there, pushes down the switch, and watch what happens. A pipe appears! Oh look, a new pipe! Come on, let's jump in! Take the orb out, and we gotta go down the pipe. Ambush! <laughs> awesome. Let me get some star points for that. Get some coins. And we use this button, click it, and now we can unlock this door. Now this part's kind of silly. Watch this. We put the punny orb here. They're all gathering about. You 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 select flurry. You take flurry out, and then you blow all them off the cliff. Blow them all away. And for some reason they. They defy the laws of physics. Well, they, <clears throat> what happens there is there, uh, there's a, like a soap thing down there that puts them in bows. And you're supposed to use Flurry's ability to blow them all over there. Alright, there we go.
Now you want to be careful here. There's spiders here. I think. There's spiders here. And what these are supposed to do is uh, use flurry. Um, Because they'll come down. It will scare the crap out of the punnies and they'll fall. You do not want them to fall. See? Come on. They'll get, they'll get scared. I think, will they get scared? Uh, no. Oh, uh, wait a minute. Or they still, they still get scared. Dang. They get scared of the punnies. Alright, there we go. What I want to do is switch, switch, well, well, uh, ouch, ouch. Switch Bella and use the tattle. That's a piter. Ugh! They gross me out. That's actually his five attack is two and defense is zero. Ew! Besides, it's normal attack is my spit three webs on you consecutively. You better have a good time or you want to guard against his attacks. It also says here that the punish can't stand piters, so I'm not the only one. Just the sight of these things may punish flee in terror. I know how they feel. Too bad I only caused one damage. Ah. Uh -huh. Ow. Oh, come on. All right, there we go. And we get six star points for that. Did anybody fall? Oh, yeah, two fell. Great. That's what. That's exactly what I was talking about. Okay, use flurry to kind of blow this away. Hmm. And, and I didn't mean for the for the ponies to fall off. Dang. I'm pressing the wrong button here. <laughs> yeah, look, I just gotta... I'm gonna go here... Oh my god! And we got a shine sprite, awesome. Why did you do that? Take that! Alright. In here... And in here, no. In here, no. In here, no. Nope. Alright, finally. 76, not bad. Cool. Alright, we just need to go back up and gather everyone else. There we go. Go down the pipe. Oh, come on. <clears throat> on this bike. Hello. Mario, did you see it? That was a Jabai. Based on what Panipper said, they're helping the intruders and trying to seize the tree. Our tribes have been enemies for a long time now. Every time we meet, we fight. A lot. But I used to get along with Jab Jabal. He's one of the Jabai tribe. I wonder if even Jabba is my enemy now. Well, it's only one way to find out. Let's come down here. Anything in these bushes? Can't go through that door yet. Wow, I found a star piece. Hey, what the hell? What the hell? Where'd he go? Oh, pfft. Okay. That was kind of weird. Did you just see that? Was somebody back here? Hey, there's something odd about this. So, you use a flurry and you blow this away. See? 
secret entrance. And the secret entrance turns out to be a little shop. This shop is hard to spot, so I've been here hiding from those goons the whole time. But those fiends have been searching high and low for something inside this tree. What could they be looking for? You have any idea? Kind of. And if you're going back here, you'll see this other guy. Hey, it's Jabu. Why are you hiding back here? Whoa, a Jabu? Not good. That little fellow's going to get mixed up in my stock. But I suppose I can't go and discipline him. He's just still a kid after all. He's just a kid, Mario. Maybe we should, you know, take it easy on him. No, let's get him. <laughs> I wonder what his deal is. He seems so lonely. Like he's watching us secretly, you know? Yeah, he almost looks like a lost little kitty cat looking for a home. Aww, it's so cute! Gumbella. <laughs> hey, you don't think he, he wouldn't want to join us, would he? And young Amai silently nodded his head. It appears you have a new ally. I heard rumors from Mount Florida to them Jabbis. Yeah, the word is out. Mario can win over the hearts of anyone and everyone. How do you know who I am? I tell you, as a people person and a salesman, I must say I'm more than a little jealous. Um, let's see. What items shall we get? Well, first off, let's use some of this stuff. How much LP do I have? Um, I think I'm good on that. Um, HP-wise, I guess I could go for some. Mini Mr. Mini. Alright, nice. We got an ice storm here. I wouldn't mind that. Wait, what? How do, bud? I bet this is your first time visiting a shop, am I right? Or am I right? Right. Then let me give you my official shop point breakdown for first timers. You earn one shop point for each item you buy. Easy so far, am I right? Now, as you build up points, you get rewarded with cool prizes, including rare items. Different stores have different prizes, so keep your eyes peeled, okay? And that, bud, is all I gotta say about that. That's... That's nice. Wanna hear all that again? Hell no. Well, alrighty then. Go on a shop or sell or store and stuff, bud. It'll be 15... Okay. Yes, I want the ice storm. I want the HP drain. Okay, how many items do I have so far? I think I'm, I'm full. I want a mini Mr. Mini too. Let me use something else. Sure, I'll use a honey syrup. Get my FP back. <clears throat> Alright. Are we good? Uh, mm, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll win with that. Alright, I'm gonna save here. And I'm gonna cut it. And so that's all for this episode, ladies and gentlemen. Sorry I didn't talk much. <laughs> it was, some, of the, some of these stuff I don't have much to say. I just be so in the zone and concentrated since this is one of my favorite and cherished games that I had growing up. So in the next episode, I'll make a, pro I'll make a promise to try to talk more. And, and so, see you guys then.